Hello everyone, and whatever time of day it is, good night, good morning, good afternoon. Today is the night. No. <laughs> I need help. Tonight, <laughs> I cannot believe I just said that. Tonight is the night that us, um, me, Josh, and the kids are going to be going home, back to New York. Um, just got a text from Josh. Yes. Okay, so, um, jo Josh is, like, down with the car right now. We're gonna go meet him downstairs because we are cleaning out Big Bird right now, which is my car that we are taking, um, to New York, and it is really dirty, and Josh brought the car into work today, and apparently he cleaned it really well, so I'm about to go see it for the first time. I'm crossing my fingers that he did a good job with it because it was so bad, um, I wanted to get it professionally detailed, but he claims that he could do it just as good, so we're about to go test that theory. Say hi. Hi. You look Christmassy. Oh, yeah. <laughs> so, let's see what you did. It actually looks better than I expected it to. I'm not yeah. gonna lie to you. It's been like an insane amount of time. It was so dirty. It was so gross. And there were so many like stains and stuff like all Good job. Me. I'm actually surprised. Give me a high five. Yeah. I could have spent more time on it, but at the same time I'm like, we're just gonna get it dirty again and like like there's a lot of like stains. So that I'm gonna get professionally done. Yeah, I was gonna say. But for this trip, if you, I ew. Could, yeah. Gross. I had to spray that because there was like baby throw up. <laughs> But it actually like looks better than I, I mean. All you'd have to get is a steam cleaner. So quick disclaimer. Quick disclaimer. Disclaimer. Um, people might be a little bit upset, but we do have the kids in um, front-facing car seats now. They are going on 21 months old. Their birthday's in February. Um, people recommend that you wait until year two, but. We really rarely have the kids in the car together at like the same time. Like we do pick up and drop offs by ourselves. So having like the um, oh, yeah. the impossible. back, it was so hard having the car seats turned away from us with yeah. both of them and being one parent. Um, it was like like they'd be doing weird stuff back here. We couldn't see them. Yeah. So they'd always be um, like making weird noises and like scaring us. Yeah. And I'd be pulling over on the side of the Cause, street because he's not in the car. Yeah, because they know how to like fake cough to get attention, and so they would pretend like they're like coughing. Choking. Or Joking and yeah, stuff, it was and we scary. wouldn't be able to see them, and so you pretty much have to stop and like go back and see what they were doing, and then they'd end up just being fine. But now we can just look back and actually see them, and honestly, it's a thousand times better. So yeah, just you're gonna be seeing that throughout the video that they're forward facing, but that is how we're doing things up in here with twins. It's different. If it was one baby, it might be a different situation, yeah. but yeah, with both of sure. them, it's like too much. Now let's look at the trunk because the, the trunk, trunk is very dirty. I didn't even think. Oh that. my god, this is not good. <laughs> Okay, so we're gonna use this suitcase though. Yeah. This I'm taking inside. I need to go back to my apartment to grab stuff. I can't. Yeah. Forget. And okay. I need to grab my wallet. Well, we should throw a lot of this away. Okay. This is all garbage. So give us a second to throw this away. I'll be right back. All right. Sophie is opening the trunk. It looks better. It's definitely. I would better. take this out, but I, we're gonna like. It's a long story. Same. Yeah. But we're taking this upstairs. We got lots of space. All right. We are good. <laughs> <laughs> Sock in hand. <laughs> okay, guys, so I have to pee. Wait, I have to pee. Don't do the Alright, I peed. So, this is our snack bag that we always use. This is actually kind of like making me like weirdly weird feelings because, okay, like we use this every time we went on a road trip and pack snacks. Oh, yeah. And that diaper bag I got so long ago and have yeah. used that on all of our trips. Can you bring the diaper bag over here? Mm -hmm. So literally we're using all of the things that we used to use. This For, diaper bag. Yeah. This and like vlogging this reminds me of when we did Colorado. Co Colorado trip. If yeah. you look back, we have a video of doing a 28 hour yeah. road trip and we used all of these things. And we haven't done like a road trip with the kids in a while, yeah. so I'm honestly really excited for tonight because just a little a family in the car. Just and I um I showed in my last video these movie things that we got. I'm really excited for these because they can watch little movies. In the car. I know I'm so excited, and we have to set those up too. Yeah. For snacks, we got all these bars. I'm literally about to dump these for in the, the bag. Yeah, these are for mainly the babies. We might steal a few, but we got some gummies. And we got these bars also, and these taste so bomb. We got some snack mix. Um, Josh, can you put this in the cupboard? <laughs> this is brownie mix. 
And we got some checks and some chips. So I'm about to just throw all of this in the bag. We have to get the babies from daycare in 15 minutes, so I wait to leave here. Um, that's why we're rushing a little bit because um, it's 5:15 and we want to be on the road by 7. So, yes. So I'm packing up the diaper bag now, and my mom called me today and said that she already has a case and a half of size six diapers, which is the size they wear at her house. So I'm not even gonna be packing that many diapers which will be really nice because um, diapers always take up like a lot of space and then I'm gonna get wiped so this is literally like all the diapers I'm bringing and then um, pack of wipes we're only gonna be there four or five days so we really don't need that much we're trying to pack really minimalistic because um, we always overpack and then I hate coming home and then having to literally unpack like a dozen million things. Yeah, okay, so, um, yeah, we can. We got the movies. It's that, I'll do it. We can't find Polar Express because Despicable Me was in the case, so. This is the closest thing we get. We might be watching Santa Claus or Despicable Me. Not Despicable Me. We might need to get a CD <laughs> somewhere, B-movie. Oh, I've seen that too many times. Mama Mia. Nope, nope, <laughs> nope, nope, nope. At least we know it's working though. We got them set up. It's actually really cute. Ice Age 3. Yes, Ice Age. Alright, we're doing our first gas Filling stop. Up gas. Before we get the babies. Because we were really low. We had like 15 miles in the car. Um, I'm realizing how not ready I am like I didn't wash my face or makeup or anything today so I'm probably gonna do that before we leave um but we're gonna go get the babies right now and then we're gonna be going to Josh's apartment so that he can get all of his clothes really quick he's like running in grabbing them we're gonna come back to my apartment put everything in the suitcases and then head out can you, can you say oh look at the sky look at the sky Siki. Yay! The sky! Sky! Yes! Yes! Good job, Good baby! Job. <gasps> the sky! I the sky! The sky! 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 <gasps> okay, guys, so we Good just got job. him, and I'm so excited. I love him. <laughs> I love you so much. <laughs> bye! Bye, yes! We're going bye bye! Okay, so Ready? we are now in my apartment. Don't cry. We're not going to <laughs> he, bed right yeah, now. Yeah, he thinks it's bedtime since we're it's changing. It's not. Him. We're just changing well, your little diaper. Yeah. He's like, "What's going on?" <laughs> when I tickle him, he like zones out. Do you have diapers? <laughs> oh, oh wait, no, they're on the kitchen counter. Oh. Mm -hmm. That big tummy. <laughs> so I got pajamas pulled out for them, so they're comfortable in the car. And they're just cute little outfits. Wait, <gasps> where'd the pants go? Found the pants, okay. Um, we need to keep stockies on them though, okay. Big dude, that's my suitcase. That's also your suitcase. Oh, what? Um, yeah, that's your Wawa. Come here. <gasps> oh my. <laughs> you forgot his stockies. Oh yeah. Come here, big. <gasps> Look at you, how freaking cute you are. <laughs> Why are they going with the suitcase? Those wheels? Uh, uh, Say wheels. Uh, <laughs> Close enough. Uh, so I am sharing the suitcase with the boys. I'm putting both mine and their stuff in there. And this is all the clothes I'm bringing. Like I said, it's only like four days. So we have all these pants and all these warm clothes that I'm really excited for them to wear. And then their sneakers. And I also have another pair of sneakers already packed. So I'm gonna transfer this over. He's excited. Are you excited to go on the trip? <laughs> okay. <laughs> A brotherly love.
<laughs> give, him, give him a fist bump. Boom. Good job. Give him a hug. Oh, what a good hug. Good job. Okay, guys. So, we just ran because there was, like, a lot more stuff that I just forgot about, like packages, mail, garbage, like all this stuff. So it is now 7.45. I'm the last one in the apartment. Emptied, like cleaned as best as I can do it last minute. The baby's just like tore it up. Um, so I just try to put it back together. But I have like pillows and blankets in my hands, camera, keys, phone, and I'm about to head out. I'm unplugging all the lights. Oh my god. And Josh and the kids are already in the car waiting for me right now. Um, and we're about to leave. First things first, though, is I need to get some Starbucks. And babies are in the car. What are you looking at, sweet love? They got their jammies on. You just dropped your bottle down. Congratulations. But we are on our way. They got their movies. Josh. And now we're going. Thank you so much for choosing Starbucks. My Starbucks. name is Riley. How are you doing this evening? I'm good. How are you? I'm doing fantastic. Thank you so much for asking. What can I get started? And so we turned their little movies back on just so they had something to watch because it kind of relaxed them a little bit. So yeah, they're just doing their little thing back here. And hopefully they will go back to sleep soon. We got a cranky baby just a little bit. He's just tired. I'm gonna come spend some time with him. You're okay, mama's coming back there. Dada's getting dead. Oh, I cannot speak apparently. <laughs> what are you doing, my little cutie baby? Dada's pumping gas. Okay, guys, so we went to a different gas station to go get some snacks and stuff because when we were out, it was really small. I'm looking where we're at on the map. Here, go, bud. So we are in 
North Carolina. I put on Despicable Me and they're having a better response to that. Uh, I think they like cartoons like a lot better than like human actors. Um, but yeah, they're just so overly tired. So Josh found some um, infant Tylenol in there. So we're just gonna give him a little dosage of that to maybe help them get more comfortable. Someone's a lot happier now. <laughs> it's his Despicable Me. Oh my gosh, their attitudes change every like five minutes. And I asked Josh to get me a water and this is what he came back with, so... <laughs> I don't know, I don't know what he's doing. just starting to get upset now so um we're about to get him out of here but this is where i'm ending this vlog but literally you guys will be seeing what's next and then you'll be seeing directly what's next in the next video so just be on the lookout for that it should be up very soon um it was a great trip went really well went really smooth honestly did not feel that long um and yeah, we're literally turning onto my street right now. So I will just see you guys in the next video. Bye, guys.